here are some updates. Here's some things that are going to be exciting for some of the people who are live here that have been doing business with me for a while. You're a client. First thing is Finance Geek Ministry. Okay. We are up and running. Okay. Finance Geek Ministry is a ministry of finance focused on helping people rediscover their kingdom authority and become masters over their personal finances and become master stewards over God's resources, right? So it's this transition from getting your household in order in the form of confidence, kingdom authority, rediscovering that authority that you have where you can gain wisdom and knowledge to take action on your personal finances. Then you master the personal finances. And then this, the last transition is or could be the first one but sometimes it's it's a it's a growing thing. So let's just say first it's master your personal finances, get your household in order, regain your kingdom authority, right? Then the transition is how do we manage God's resources? What are God's resources? Well, if you are a believer, you believe that God owns it all. So it so it goes from you start changing the terminology of my personal finances and my authority to this is God's authority whom I have access to who has given me authority based on his authority. He has given me authorization and he has given me the ability to move forward in my finances, which is no longer now my finances. It's, it's actually his finances because he's given me access to resources because he has an infinite amount of resources. He is the source of the resource that has been given to me, amen? Boom, so now I got these resources that I have access to that now I have been commanded, I have been told, I have been called out, I have been anointed, whatever religious term you wanna use, I have been in assignment, walking in purpose, to multiply the resources that I receive from source, follow me? So now I have these resources that I have access to and my kingdom mandate is to multiply the resources, be fruitful and have and replenish, right? Multiply, replenish, which is a recipe for dominion to have control, control, not ownership, control, control, control over everything around you, right? Everything, not everyone, everything that creepeth the earth, right? Everything, thing. And then to collaborate with another king or queen to quadruple or 10x the resources. I mean, come on. Is this not a recipe? It's a recipe. So boom. Know your numbers. Core service. Finance Geek Ministry. You can sign up on the website. DenzelRodriguez.com. I have a website being built specifically for Finance Geek Ministry. What I'm going to do real quick. Share with you my screen so that you can see exactly what I am talking about. So let's go here. Share screen. Boom. I will copy paste this link in the chat so you guys see it. Finance Geek Ministry. Again, I have been so blessed. 27 years old. Now have the ability with the amount of passive income I've been able to bring in. I now have the ability. I now have the time to give freely to thee because I want to give 100% of me to thee, which is you, right? In covenant. Here's how we do it. If you're willing to exchange your social currency, I'm willing to give you my time coaching one-on-one. -on -one. This is for those who are negative cash flow, low cash flow, tough financial situation, trying to regain your authority, trying to master your personal finances. You're just, you're in a rut, right? You don't know how to make sense of investing in yourself because you've never done it before for the 40, 50 years you've been on planet earth. No shots fired. This is just speaking the truth, right? No shots fired. And you are maybe someone that struggles with allowing help to come into your life. Well, here's a very easy, non-judgmental, efficient way to do that. Name right there, email, free coaching opportunity. And then right below here is a free course, right? To get your mind right, get your money right. And you get access to the accountability group, which is the Ecclesia Gathering. Let me go into that. So in the Ecclesia Gathering, right here, right below, <clears throat> what we do here, every first and last Friday of every month, 8 p.m. Eastern time via Zoom, we gather, we answer questions. I have other speakers present topics, present situations, do case studies, run numbers. We're spending time together. We're, we're worshiping together. We're praying together. We're growing together. We're building together. Okay. That's part of finance geek ministry. No cost to you. All you have to do is be willing to give, be willing to show up. 
From there, this is a new thing, the Kingdom Business Highlight. I was talking to a few clients about this. The Kingdom Business Highlight is something I wanna be able to do at least once per month where I create content, maybe do an email blast, where I'm leveraging my platform, leveraging my community to really help my clients who are also business owners that are also kingdom-minded, they're kingdom-driven entrepreneurs, they're faith-driven entrepreneurs, they're building businesses on earth, right? And I now am in a position of authority, credibility, and influence on social media where I can leverage the platforms that I use, the systems that I've been able to build and automate. And it's like an added on value to my existing clients for investing in me early on. So it's like, here's a reward for trusting a 20 something year old who has no credibility, who has no you know qualified positions or certifications or licenses or experience here, right? You're, you're, you're about to get poured and continue to be poured on for the rest of your days because you believed in the least of thee, right? So in so how you treat the least of thee, if I'm saying that right, how you treat the least of them is how you treat the father, right? So for those of you who've known me since 2018, when, when it was just a little whiteboard, a terrible lighting, terrible audio, top of the heads cut off, you can see my my bed in the background. You can see me in my in my bedroom. Literally, you know, you know the term. Every time a content creator throws shots at another content creator, it's like, oh yeah, he's probably in his mom's basement. Yeah, that's me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's me for sure. Boom. And to now see that progress, and you're like, oh my lord, wow, look what you've done for him. Lord, look what you've done. How how majestic are you? How I glorify you, Lord. Boom, right? You're you're about to get poured in this season. For those of you who have been with me since day one, for those of you who have committed to me for your personal fine for your gain, you committed to me for your gain. You're about to get some pouring. It's gonna be really sweet. So I'm leveraging all the skills I have now to create some bad content. I, and when I mean bad, I mean good, like some good content, highly edited, nice audio, good visuals. I mean, good everything, clean. Imagine having a spokesman whom you don't have to pay a dime and they're gonna put you in front of thousands of eyeballs for you to promote your businesses, right? So again, this is for kingdom-driven entrepreneurs, faith-driven entrepreneurs, people that are clients of mine that are building businesses. This is another value add-on. Once we do this, you see, I'm not just gonna promote any kingdom entrepreneur just because you say, Denzel, I'm part of the kingdom. Yeah, yeah, okay, what are your four major numbers, right? We need to get this in line. I need people who can handle what I'm about to bring them. I need people who are ready to manage God's resources and steward over them. So I need to make sure these numbers are cleaned up. I need to make sure you got a good head on your shoulders. I need to make sure you are disciplined. Yeah, 27 year old talking to 47, to a 57, to a 67. Yeah, I have that authority because I answer to a higher authority. So when the higher authority gives you authority, watch out, okay? You gotta be able to respect that. As kingdom citizens, we need to respect each other's authority, especially when you've been called and anointed and confirmed, right? It's a big deal. So if this ain't in line and you're just trying to jump over here and, and leverage my audience and all, eh, you know, I'm gonna be able to weed that out. I'm gonna be able to see that early on. So those who are seeking out to become kingdom leaders, right? This is now a call to those who maybe are not clients, to those who have been following me for some time. For those of you who came from a different angle, maybe one of my partners and you've heard of me and you started watching me a little bit, I'm now calling out kingdom leaders. I am seeking out kingdom leaders, financial coaches, pastors, faith-driven entrepreneurs, kingdom content creators. For those of you who are clients of mine and you know anyone, that is like that, pastor, financial coach, faith-driven entrepreneur, kingdom content creator, send them my way, email me directly, send them my way, this might be a good fit for you, Denzel, this might be a good partnership, Denzel, okay, da, da, da. I wanna team up with some other kingdom people to expand Finance Geek Ministry because really one of the first of its kind, right? You've heard of ministries that help single moms, you've heard of ministries that help um, people on drugs, on rehab, uh, counseling, divorce, marriage, teens, singles, couples, you, um, for homeless. Guys, have you ever heard of a ministry of finance? A ministry that is dedicated to financing God's citizens to, to help them become financiers of the kingdom? Have you ever heard of that before? I haven't, okay? Brand new, 
brand new stuff. So it's going to be interesting, right? So that's a beautiful thing that's going to be rolling out. I'm going to start this month with highlighting a king of business. And that's when, again, I create content, maybe an evil blast, right? Just promotion, just glorifying people, right? Next is kingdom sponsorships and kingdom grants. This is something that I did or have been doing every year where I will give my course away. I'll give coaching uh, or big program, or I literally just give money to help for a certain thing or a business idea. So this is something that I'm now officiating where I'm going to create a form where I need a business plan. I'm going to, I'm going to get more data. And then once I have the data of a few different applicants and I'm going to look through it and pick the one that is coming to the table most prepared, most ready, or whatever the father says. So I'm combining logic and Holy Spirit to give me an answer to give a kingdom grant, which is literally money, or a kingdom sponsorship, which is money in the form of a course program my time, right? In that sense. So that's really, really cool. 